Hello everybody, James here from It's Much More, thanks for stopping by. So, yes, we are playing all three cartridges, which is the Atari Collection 1, Namco Museum Collection 1, and the Data East Collection 1 on the Evercade tonight. So, the Atari Collection 1 has 20 games included, the Namco Museum has 11, and the Data East has 10. So, yeah. I'm not going to be playing a full playthrough for all these games, I'm just going to be basically playing through as much as um, as I like. So whether I get bored or I just uh, have a couple of goes and continues, then I'll play through them. So I saw this one in a shop in Derby recently, so I was going to purchase that, but uh, I don't have a an Atari 7800, so uh, it would have just been purposes for the case being on the side and sitting next to an Evercade. So let's... Uh, Stop talking and let's start playing. So let's uh, set the screen resolution to have it the full size. Right, let's go. <laughs> so this is if you're a fan of the brigade. I might uh, just turn that down ever so slightly. Give me a moment. Here we go. Right, let's go. I'm gonna have it on novice because I'm not that good at computer games. So let's do this. So we have some civilians as well that will disguise themselves as... Well, they have some aliens disguise themselves as civilians. If you haven't checked the videos already, I've got uh, my Atari Top 5 games. So uh, does this make it on there? Then check it out. I've got a list at the end of this video in it. Oh, damn it. At the end of every... One of these videos that I'm doing of my Atari Top 5 games. And also the Top 5 for the Pacific cartridge that I'll be playing through. So, uh. Should really have a light gun for this. But it's pretty cool using uh, the handheld Evercade. I'm trying to pick up those P icons, whatever they are. Whoa! Oh no. Back this way we go. Give me that alien. I don't know who I'm supposed to be shooting here. I think just everyone's just against me. Not him. Ammo. Take the parachute is down. Get that grenade. There we go. Nicely cleared up. Throw a grenade down. Save those grenades for the boss. Whoa. So we've got to wait for the, I think, my team to get in the helicopter when it arrives at the end, so that's what I'll be trying to do. What's he doing? Another alien. dude. There they go. Set them free. Have some of that. Free. Did I do it? Or didn't I? Okay, so that's that one done. Alien Brigade. Adventure now. So number 2 of 20. So there are 20 games on this Atari cart, so we'll start on this level. We'll do level 1. Right. Let's get the key. Can't go in there yet. Or can I? 
Yes, I can. Right, so I'm going to need that sword. Let's go. Let's go this way. Right, take that black key. Get down. Wait for him to come back. Quick, get that black key. Let's go. Put that over there. So I can't open that door. Right, so I've got to find either the black gate or castle for that. Oh, watch out. Oh, get off. Let's go down here. Oh, nope. Getting caught. Quickly, run. Oh, get off me. I'm in his belly. Oh. Right. That's me stuck. So, next game. <laughs> That would be more fun, right? Okay, so what is this? Aqua Venture. Getting through these games rather quickly. Let's go. I don't think this game was originally released. But it looks awesome. Oh. oh. Fun little game, this one. Looking forward to the um oh the television cartridge. Never had a television before. Oh no. Let's try that again. Let's go down this bit. Nice colours on this one. Watch out for the missiles and the fish. It's that little house. There we go. Let's go back up. Get some air. What's that? What was that? I'm just supposed to kill all the fishes on the screen. Oh! Right, let's change game. That's pretty cool. Next. Right, what's this? Asteroids. Nineteen eighty-one. Gosh. We'll do it on level one. How many levels are there? Oh, let me know. Now we restart that. Try that again. All right. 1981. Stick with level one. Let's go. So it's asteroids with lots of colours. Whoa! It sounds like Jaws. Oh. It's pretty cool. Works all right on the other code. Once again, no input lag or delay or graphical issues. That's it. Next game. All right, what have we got now? Cannonball Bomber. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Reminds me of like Harry Attack. There's me, I think. Have I started yet? No, let's go. So just got to clear the amount of, uh, yeah, the most ones to get all the uh, pieces of the ship, I think, blown up. Wins, points. So that's pretty fun. Can't do anything else. So I think he's winning. Let me change sides. Different planes as well. Yeah, he's winning quite a lot. Now my helicopter. Big plane from the top. Nowhere near catching him up though. Helicopter now this time. Slow helicopter now. Right, I hope we should get some points. No. Nope. Hopefully get that one. No. Nope. Oh yes, that helped. I'm catching him up. Being a fast plane. Not many blocks left. 
Oh, I'm sure I got that one there. And that one. I think that's it. I lose. Right, okay. Next. Next game. Oh yes, Crystal Castle. Crystal Castles. Awesome game, 1984. Okay, so let's click these lines. So I'm a bear. And then it's supposed to be either berries or apples. Whoa. You get away from those faces. See, it works awesome. Kind of like a Pac Man style game. Just click these things. Those two up there, those heads have gotten stuck, I think, which is fine for me. No, they're just waiting around by that top one up there. Wait, right. Next level. So we've got a ladder now. Nice right, so a bee and honey and trees. Jump over those trees. Uh oh. They're going for the honey. Or they're going for me. Right, oh, they're gone now. Let's quickly get these. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, come the bees again. Oh, watch out. Might have to use that ladder in a minute. Oh, they're all blocking it. Let's get that honey. Go! Got the honey. So bees shouldn't come. How many have I got left? Oh, what? Got one more bit left. No, two. One. Oh, it's gone. No, there's one there. Quick. No. Yes. Bigger level now. Skeleton. Big ladder. Let's use that little lift. Quickly get those. Imagine this on an Atari joystick. It's quite it works quite well on the D-pad. Right. Try and get that little lift. Come on. Which lift is it? Oh, I missed it. Oh no. Anyway, next game. That's a fun game anyway, I like that. I could play that for ages. Right, on to number seven on this cartridge. A centipede. The Atari 2600 version. Just popping by, uh, half time during the Southampton game. Hello, Retro Gaming Revival. How you doing, my friend? Hopefully, uh, if you're a Southampton fan, hopefully they're winning or doing well. Oh, doing better than what I am. So, yeah, Centipede on the Evercade. That spider and whatever that is. Oh, next level. Let's get through these. That spider again. Oh, I forgot I can move up. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Whoa. See that they say the uh games aren't difficult, but they are. Old games, they say they're easy and simplistic, but yes, they might be simplistic, but they are blimmin' difficult. Oh! Right, next game. Number eight on the collection, Double Dunk. <laughs> Losing as always. Southampton. Oh, well. Here we go. Bit of Double Dunk. I was playing NBA Jam earlier, so uh, let's see how this compares. Totally different.
if we can get started. Player one, yes, yeah, me. Let's go. Oh, who's got the ball? What the? What just happened there? I've got it. I've not got it. My goodness. Let's go. I've got it. Have I got it? This ball. Travel. You mean travelling? Alright. Oh, he shoots from there. Yes, yes, yes. Pass it. Oh, I go. I've not got it. I'm the green guys, yeah? What the? Right, next game. Don't know what's going on with that one. No wonder that went in my top five. This game is an amazing game. And this one was in the shop in Derby. I was going to pick it up. It should be a Premier League goalkeeper with reflexes like that. Yes. Here we go. Click these things. Watch out for that. Click those things there. Yeah, this is... Oh, what happened there? Who did I get it by? Click those things on the floor. Alright, one more thing. Let's get them. And that... What was that? Yeah, I do like this game. And I should have I should have picked it up. Next time I go Derby, I don't think it's gone. Uh, it will be gone. Because uh, when I saw a picture on Google, on the photos for the shop, this uh, game was still in the cabinet. It's only £6. Boxed. Oh, so, uh... I just like the look of it. Never owned it before. Oh, come on now. Whoa, whoa. Da, 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 da. Right. Let's have a quick cup of tea. Change the next game. I like that one. Number 10 now. We're halfway through. Cartridge number one. So give me a moment. This is Food Fight 1987. Ah, quite a popular one. Many people like this. I don't think I like it too much. I just think it's a bit odd how he opens his mouth. Really weird. And for some bizarre reason as well, I drink hot tea now really quickly. I don't know why. But let me just finish this and then we'll get on. Because we're nearly halfway through, like I said. We are halfway through the first cartridge. And then we'll get on to Namco Museum 1 and then Data East. This live stream was going to be tomorrow, but I thought I'd do it today instead. Because I've got a free night, so let's do it. Right, we're nearly ready. Hold on. Mm. And there you go, bit of a, a bit of ASMR for you there. Drinking. Right. Let's do this. Food fight, one player, intermediate, advanced, expert, two players. No, not got two players yet. We do beginner, because I'm rubbish at computer games. Yes, start on this level. Thank you. What do we do? Eat the cone. Let's go. That's that. Let's go and get that cone. Oh, that's easy enough. Three. Alright, what do we do now? Same again, eat the cones. What are these here? This, okay. Right, so I can see why many people like it. Hey, where are you going? Because it is, yeah, it's a pretty alright game, I guess. So it's kind of overlooked then in my top five, I guess. But, you know, I made my top five and everyone else has their own opinions. Most of which are always put in the comments to my videos, so I do appreciate it, because I like to hear everyone else's uh, top five games per cartridge. Get out of it. Have that. Did, oh, is the cone melting? Pretty cool. I imagine this would be pretty decent on uh, two players. Maybe a game to play on the uh, Evercade VS. Have a watermelon. Oh. Right, okay, next game. Okay, so that one was also in that Derby shop as well, so I might pick up that as well. I might pick up an Atari 2600 then, just to have sat there. 
something to play, I guess. What's this? Gravitar. 1983, the year I was born. Gosh. Let's see how good this was. Let's see what the games were like when I was around, when I was a kid. Oh, gosh. Whoa. Uh, what the? What is this? Don't know what I'm doing here. Do I click that? No, next game. Okay, yes. Missile Commander. This is a good game. And this is what I've just recently taken part in the uh, the Facebook group challenge. But for the uh, on the Atari Lynx version. Now this is an awesome game. Just got to make sure you get the uh, missiles. Stop the missiles from hitting the bases down the bottom. Then you've got a certain amount of ammunition. Yeah, this is cool. You can see in the bottom there, there's my ammo. My score going up. Get more score for the bases that are still left. So if you do like this video, please click that like button. If you want to check out some of our other Evercade videos, we do have them in the Evercade playlist. So we have a uh, live stream, we have chats, we have top five games per cartridge. And we have a couple of playthroughs as well. So yes, the year I was born. Nice one, same age as me then. Come on, both look young, don't we, for our age. Alright, next game. Motor Psycho. Number 13 out of 20, so we're nearly done the first cartridge already. This isn't going to be uh, as long as I thought this stream. Here we go. Here we go, so if you like Hang On, then you might like this game. How do we change gear? Let's jump. Whoa! Okay, up is change gear on the D-pad, and that's also jump as well, so you get used to that. So it's no hang on, but it is quite impressive though for its age. Let's go back to low gear and go to high gear. I like the fact you can jump. Whoa! God, blimmin hell, those turnings are a bit uh, unforgiving. Back to low gear. Nice frame rate though, it looks impressive. Oh, there's little bits to jump over. God, just the turnings, how they approach, just don't give you much time to, to think about it. Whoa! Oh, I landed on him. Anyway, next game, that's awesome. I do like racing games. Oh no, speaking of racing games, this one ain't that good. Night Driver. Cool, blimmin now, I've got to play this, have I? Right, okay, let's go. Oh, look at that. Whoa! Cool. Some games aren't that good. I mean, yes, it might have been impressive back in the day, but look. Where do you go? And yes, I know it's at night, and that's probably the only things that you see at night. At least a little bit of light in front of you. And I know they are the cat's eyes on the road or the edges of the road. But come on now. Next game, please. Thank you. Right. 15. Ninja Golf. One of the popular ones on this cartridge. Okay, so let's do it. Ninja Golf. We'll have it on easy again. Kamikaze mode, no thank you. Where's easy mode gone? There it is. Nine holes of Ninja Golf. Okay. So here's hole number one. Let's go up there. So you can see in the bottom left hand side, I'm changing the angle where I'm going to shoot. Oosh, have that. And obviously I've got to take out some enemies on the way. Got a bit of a shield. Watch out for that mouse. Little kick. Oh, oh. How do I think I'll throw nunchucks? There you go. What's the button for nunchucks? I want to kick, do I? I just want to play some golf. 
Ja, also dann schauen wir mal. How do I use them? Oh, you just stand still, right? Okay. Right, okay. I was pressing the other direction. Oh, I've got none left. Reminds me of that uh, karate game, not Ya Kung Fu. What is that one where you have to block the uh, the different ball things that face you and there's three of you on the screen at once? I think it came out the same sort of time as Barbarian. Yeah, the train on that. Is, how long is this going to last? Got some more health. There we go. Right, so let's play some golf. So it should be just called uh, Attacking, then Golf. Oh, that's rubbish. All right, anyway, moving on. Cool game. If you like that sort of thing. Here we go. Steeple Chase. Right, 16 out of 20 on cartridge number one. How do we do it? On your marks. Go. Okay, we just have to jump over the hurdles or the uh, the fences for the horse racing. I'm the one at the bottom. So I've got to time your jumps. My back foot hit it there. So this is like the Grand National. And they're off. Number one, number two, number two, number two, number two. Oh, it's getting faster. Oh, click the back legs. And again. Come on, horse. I like those uh, Grand National games in the arcade. Those 20p ones or the 10p ones. Oh, that you put your money in. And it just... Uh, Grand Slam, I think it's called, or something. Grand Stand. Yeah, I'm winning this. Regardless of hitting each of the hurdles, the jumps. I don't know how long this lasts for. But it's safe to say that I'm alright. Oh, I know what I'm doing with this one. Look at that. Gliding through. There he is. Oh, he can't clear those ones. Right, next game. We're on number 17 now. Sword Quest Earth World. IK was the game you were thinking of. It was Crazy Burger. Yes. Hello. Good evening. How are you doing? My live stream got changed for today instead of tomorrow. Right, so let's go. So it's kind of like adventure, with a bit more graphics. And you can only go certain doors. What have I got? Some odd looking uh, items. So I think that's a little dagger. I don't know if that's a grappling hook and some rope. Oh! Uh, this way. Nope. This way. Oh, what's that? I think that's my inventory or something else. It's just going to be up and down, is it? Do this carry on going down? Ah, oh, I remember why I didn't play this game. Next game. Right, okay, so Tempest. A popular game, but probably not the best version of it. Let's give it a go. Yeah, not the best version of it. I have met Jeff Minter. He was at an event that I went to in Froome in Somerset. Somerset. And uh, yeah, that's all I'm going to say. And that's all I'm going to play on this game. So well done, you. Next game is Video Pinball, number 19 of 20 of this first cartridge. So uh, as you can imagine, it's a pinball game. You can change the. Uh, if you wanted to change the design of the pinball machine so we'll pick one that don't look like vomit uh, which one don't look like vomit they all do all right um ew, no way good god uh it's got to be saying that looks half decent let's do my eyes in right let's start that again there we go this one looks good right what's the flippers left and right okay I like the little Atari logo in there. Let's see if we can get that. It's pretty cool. It's no Sonic Spinball or Advanced Pinball Simulator, but it is uh, a pinball, pinball game. There's no scaling of the screen, so you can't go up or down. Just 
I press up to them both. Okay, that's cool. Oh, I nearly got the Atari logo. Come on, let's get that logo. Oosh. This ain't doing nothing, is it? This? What a load of rubbish this is. <laughs> My goodness. Ooh. It's not as good as actually playing on a pinball machine, is it? Come on. Hit this blooming. Oh, hit this blooming thing. There it is. What's it doing? Good God. Oh, no. Oh, where's that going? It's, look at the state of this. Right. Oh, gosh. I'm spending too much time on this one, I think. Come on. Wait, whoa, whoa. Look at that. What happened there? Oh, nearly. Come on, I just want that Atari logo. Oh, right, next game. <laughs> Hey, the final game, everyone's favourite. What's this? Oh my god, that version of Tempest, 1 out of 10. Bobby Dobbs, indeed. Couldn't agree more. Right, someone's favourite, Yars Revenge. What the? This is a bit different. Is that the final level? Well, let me just change that again. Let's do level 0. What is this? I don't remember this level. I don't recall playing these games much. No. No, I don't think I've played any of them. I think I did a top five and I think that's about it. This is doing my eyes in. No. What was that? Was that Yars Revenge? Oh, Yars Return. That's why I've not played it. I think I'll skip that game. Alright, and speaking of skipping, we are now on to cartridge number two. So let's uh, take that cartridge out. Nice and firm cartridge there. We're moving on to the Namco. Museum Collection 1. We have a mouthful, but there should be some good games on here. It's Namco, so they should look a bit more impressive than that. Well, they do already. So we've got 11 games on here. We're going to start off at the beginning. Battle Cars. Okay. Let's change the size of it first, the screen. It's already full screen, good. There it is. There's my cars. So you choose the design of them. Thank you everybody for watching as well. If you want to click that like button. Oh, a lot of you have already. Thank you. Uh, Yars Return is the sequel to Yars Revenge. Wow. Okay, so the car we're going to choose is this car here. This car. Yep. All right, and what color we're going to have? Yeah, I like that color there. New, New Detroit. Oh. Where do we go? Oh! What's the keys? Okay, that one. Here it is. Yep, so if you're a fan of Street Racer F Zero, the first Mario Kart on the SNES, you might like this style of game. What is it? We're just. That's all we're doing. Battling cars. I think this rated quite highly on my. Uh, top five list purely because there's it was a racing game but uh, yeah I should re revisit uh, my top five list because it might change I might do a, a revamped one because if I'm just looking at the car there's not much going on with the car no, it stays still yeah nothing going on but it's all about the background isn't it and that those letters over there just remind me of it the logo of it I don't know why Well, was that the boss? It says five, four, three. Finished it. Mode seven, baby. Yes, indeed. Very power drift. All right, dig dug. Yes, there we go. Number two of eleven on this cartridge. This has got to be a good game to play, and I like this one. Oh yes, look at this. Do do do. Classic. Namco here. I like it because if you don't move. There's no music, but when you move... <laughs> Come here. Oh, where's that guy going? You're protecting that flower, I think. Don't know the story beyond this. Let's 
get rid of these. A dragon will come along now. Come on then, mate. Oosh. Have that. Alright, okay. Let's get these done. Oh, you can do that as well. That's cool. Where are you going? You ain't coming out. That's scary, though, that uh, face. Oh, no. Awesome game, though, Dig Dug. Right. I like how that looks as well. 1985. See, look, the game, the, cha the changes to the games. I don't know if these are, are the arcade versions or whatever, but they're probably not because there's an arcade collection coming out, but you're just comparing the years that came out from Atari to Namco. They're just like, smash it out of the park. Right. Galaxian. An awesome game here as well. Look at this. Just remember this from Ridge Racer on the PlayStation 1. And those things at the top there as well. They were in Pac-Man, I think, as well. Or have been. Those aliens. There we go, got rid of one of them. So Space Invaders, you know, esque. Do you like the nice little twinkling stars in the background as well? Just so much nice things going on with this one. Beautiful colour work on it as well. It does play nice on the Evercade handheld as well. Whoa, watch out. They're flying around now. Cool, blooming hell. See, look. Oh, that's a nice uh, effect when you die. Mostly NES versions on here. Now, what's this? Uh, have you got an exotic cider tonight? No. What did I have? I had a Koppenberg. Well, I had a Koppenberg. What, what Koppenberg was it? I can't remember. Tropical fruit one or something. But it tasted just like the um, old mount uh, pineapple flavour. It was really odd. And then I've had a cup of tea. So yeah, no, no Lily ciders tonight. That was just a special one for the live stream. That's why I dressed up looking all sharp. There we are. Not doing that again. Right, okay. So next. Number four. Okay, so let's do this. I think this is the one that I didn't know what I was doing. Cool, that's bright. Okay, so what are we doing then? Yep, press start. Surra surround the treasures. Okay. Oh, whoa. Hey! There's only that one. Try it. Surround the treasures. Just did. Do I do it with the other dude? Oh, you press, wait, you press A to move the blue guy. This is so bright for this time of night. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How do you move it? That's odd. So he is, oh wow, that's difficult controls. I probably will get used to it. Like that. There you go, have some of that. Oh, it reminds me of a, a MAME game. A very uh, different style of MAME game. Have some of that. Are they the bu bubble guys? No, they can't be. Mm -mm -mm -mm. There we go, let's get that. Uh... Oh yeah, I forgot about moving him. Right, okay. Let's keep him over there. Get rid of all this. over it. It's difficult to do. Oh, wow. Okay, next game. Impressive, but, you know, would be cool with two players on that one. Oh, no. Mappy. I've got Al from Games Rib's favourite game. Mappy. Here it is. Little policeman mouse. Oh. That's dead. Right, okay, what do I do then? Have I got any other weapons? Get ready. Get ready. How do I do? What do I do? This is why I don't like this game. I don't know what I do. Pressing the buttons, nothing's happening. Yes, yes, yes. We get the idea. Alright. Open doors. No, you can't stop them. So do I just pick up everything? Hmm. 
it's all a bit fast for me. Oh, I can go to the top. To the top. Oh. Now I'll have map ED. Well, tell me what. Can you tell me what I've got to do here? Because I don't know what I'm doing here. Crazy burger. So I'm the, obviously the policeman and the, the cats are the robbers, I guess, yeah? But why can't I do anything to them? I can't jump or anything. Dun, 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 dun. They're just chasing me, so I can't open the door that way. Oh, I can. You need to collect all the stuff. Right, okay. Let's try that again then. Oh, way difficult. No, oh, see, this is just. They're just gonna all come and get me. So there's no reason why I'm a policeman then, though. No? What does that do? Sounds the alarm. Whoa. <clears throat> so it's a bit like... Uh, oh, great. It's a bit like Flicky. One button, one of the buttons sends out a laser thing. Well, I'm pressing A and B and not doing nothing. Huh. Huh. Pressing all the buttons there. Try the triggers. No. What have we got? I can't see the controls. They're just too quick anyway. No, leave it. That's why I didn't play this game. Is that the laser thing there that you're on about? I think that opened one of the doors. The flashing doors, press the button. Yeah, well, see, look, I just. Oh no, not another mappy game. Mappy kids. Alright, what's this? Dear Happy. I thought it was Mappy. Right. Oh, it's Super Mario Brothers. Free. It sounds exactly like it. Where am I? Oh, I'm here. Wait, this sounds exactly like... <laughs> Mario Brothers. What are we doing? So this is totally different to what we just played there. This looks... plays better already. In my opinion, because we've got to say that on everything we do on the old YouTube, because people... Oh! So you get hit once. Can I kick them? I can kick them. Seems a bit angry when he kicks. Oh, rollerblades. Oh, I've got... I guess I've got them on, because I'm faster now. They look like Alex Kid up there, the coins. So you've got Mario sound and Alex Kid icons. Whoa, what's that? What is that that I'm picking up? Alex Kid money. Diamonds. Oh, I see hand jump on the clouds. Whoa, that just fell down. Can I get on that thing there? Whatever that is, this part of the tree. Right, let's go up here. Oh, yes. Let's just make our way to that uh, end bit over there. Just rush through it. What's that? Water balloon. So I'm guessing they kill me. Apologies if this is hurting anyone's eyes, because it is mine. Oh. It should take out the cats. Was that for the last game or this game? Oh. We're nearly there to that. Exit point, I think. Here we go. Whoa, no, I can't make that. Ah, oh, what? You're having a joke. All the way back. Oh, no, it's not. Halfway. Okay. We'll do that. We'll do it. Ah. Oh. Right, next. Number 7 of 11. Metal Marines, 1993. And this is a great game. And I think I should have put this higher on my top five because yeah I really do like it. Uh here it is. <laughs> Thought it wasn't gonna work there. So thank you everybody that is watching live on YouTube. It's good to have you with me as we're playing some Evercade games live. 
using the HDMI mini cable to uh, play it. What's this? Start. So, so yeah. So tonight we've already played through the Atari Collection 1, all the games on there, played those. This is the Namco Museum 2 Collection 1, and then we're going to move over to Data East Collection 1 after that. And this is an awesome game. If you haven't done so already, why not think about subscribing to the channel? Got loads of arcade stuff on there, and uh, other games as well. And other formats. So where we're going to put our base? We'll put a base here. There that goes. Right. What we got now then? Let's put this around here. So you're going to get to see this cool game if you haven't done so already. Number of bases. Oh, I should have put them in different areas, but it doesn't matter. No. I want to change that a little bit. So I'm going to put one here, deploy the bases. So I'm going to put one over here, next to this little village. And then we'll put uh, just one, this little part of the road. I am watching interesting systems. Sega Sox, thanks for stopping by, my friend. No idea how to play this. Well, this is pretty cool. So look, I'm going to put some... Uh, I'm not going to put a dummy base down, but I'm going to put... Um, wherever this is. A dummy unit. Put that over there. Put a dummy base down. Whoa, look at all this. There's my dudes there, look. I think we're done now. Don't want to delete a unit, build up. Select a unit to build up. Let's build up that one. So yeah, when the enemies are approaching in a moment from the sea, they'll try and shoot me. Grid mode. I'll take that off the info. No. Here they come. Here comes the attack. Yes. So a lot of my bases should already take care of these. Uh oh. oh. What was that doing? Didn't go anywhere near mine. That's it, my inventory, my rockets, take care of them. Uh oh. Hopefully, take care of that base, but I think they're going to drop a rocket down or a, a robot. Oh no. Dropping a robot down. There they are. So, I've got 60 seconds, I think, to make some impact. Well, they have. Right, so. Let's fire some rocket. Let's lay down some uh, different things in. I'm going to want to put a robot down because I like them. So we'll put him there, in the middle of the road. Was this one on the SNES? I don't know. I've never, never seen it before. Anti-aircraft. This is the first time I've ever seen this game on the uh, Evercade. Oh, enemies attacking. Oh no, what we got now? Are they moving their robot or are they just firing missiles? Oh no, they got through! Ah, oh, my new one I think got rid of that one. That's it. Their ship's coming, oh no. Oh no! It's landing. Oh, they put some rockets in. Oh no! So I'm just watching what's going on at the moment. I'm taking care of my bases. Can I do something? No. Oh my goodness. All clear, yeah. It looks like a stairs game. Like SimCity. Right, okay, so... We need to put some of these things down and recover. Put that there. Anti-air missile, just to replace what's just gone off. I need to get rid of, delete these. Can't delete them because they've been mashed up. Okay. Can I put a dummy unit? Our enemies attacking now. Come on. 
Oh, they dodged my missiles. Oh, what? At least they're not near my base. Oh, the new one. <sighs> Close. Right, we need we need to take care of uh, them. So what's this? Landmines. See, that's not going to do anything. Factory. Let's build a factory there. What's that? Ego plant. Yeah, let's build that. What? I ain't got enough money. How much money have I got? Let's put some missiles in it. Let's put some more missiles. We need them. Can't deploy them. Enemy attacking. Oh my goodness. Reminds me a little bit of like Rampart. At parts. What's this? Oh, getting closer. Here comes a ship in a minute. There it is. Oh, no. What? It's landing there. What is it? Oh. Oh, no. So I don't like how I can't do anything. Oh, no. Just watching him take care of my bases. Oh, no. See, they've got 47 seconds, 45 seconds to do their attacks, but cleared them off now. See, look, you can play this for ages, but I'm not going to. It's a good game. It should have been higher on my top five list. It's a 16-bit game. It doesn't say what it was on, but probably going to be the uh, the SNES. I wouldn't have seen that on the Mega Drive. Right, we've got Pac-Man now. A classic game. We all know what this is. The 8-bit version, so it's probably the NES version. Here we go. Classic Pac-Man. Let's see how far I can get then, shall we? So there's no input lag and the D-pad works really well on here as well. Right, that's how I find it anyway. Because I've got Pac-Man on a couple of different variations, like a, a little um, basic fun little arcade machine. And the D-pad on here works a bit better than that. So we just collect all the pellets. Stay out of the way of the ghosts. Some awesome Pac-Man arcades there are at the moment. Um, a massive uh, four-player one at my local arcade. At Matlock Bath. So, uh, yeah. If it's still there. You know, due to what's going on in the world now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, ah. Oh. I always thought on um, one of the versions of this, when he died, it turned into like a little apple core. Because I thought he was always an orange. Pac-Man, back in the day. Not an apple. So when he died, I thought it turned into like a core. Alright, next level. Don't think the uh, level layout's changed. Whoa. Get that uh, strawberry there. 300 points for that one. Get these ghosties. Can I beat the high score? I don't think I can. Not like that, I can't. Oh. Damn it, last life left. Here we go. He's surrounded that pellet. Is that strawberry that? Let's go this way. We're nearly beating the high score, I think. Shouldn't have done that way. Oh, okay. Whoa! Doodle -doodle 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 -doodle. Reminds me of um, some dizzy games like fast food. This bit here. It's probably where I got the idea from, or vice versa. See, same level again. Let's try and get that high score. He's 
Change direction. Oh, cheeky so and so. Alright, let's get that orange. Or that apple, whatever it is. Orange thing. 500 points for that one. Oh, why'd I go that way? Can we beat the high score? Yeah! I've set the high score now. Obviously it's an awful score compared to people's, but uh, I don't mind. Whoa! Quick, go and get that pellet. Okay. No, where are you going? We're doing alright, we're doing alright. Let's get that one. There's one more left. Yes! Right. Same map again. The same pellets in the same location. Whoa, he's faster! I think. Pac Man has got faster now. Whoa! So I've still got this is now this is my final life. Unless I get another one. But how awesome is this so yes I know it's not the uh, arcade version, but it's still cool, it still looks nice, it still plays good. See I've been playing it now for probably one of the longest times on at the free cartridges so far. On this video, so I'm still enjoying it, even if it's the same level. Oh my goodness. Game over. There you go, try and be that high score. Alright, okay, what are we on to next? Oh, he's got headphones on, that's pretty cool. Right, number 9, Quad Challenge. 16-bit game. There he goes, revving up. 50cc liquid-cooled two-stroke engine. It's revving up the throttle. What's that, some spent suspension? Front suspension, yes. Here they go, now the hot race is going to start. Hot race. Mm. There you go, the crowd's going wild. In silent. In silence. There we go, quad challenge. Looks dirty. So, oh. All good. Right, USA. We won't put my name in. We'll do the USA Championship. Um, background music, yeah, put that on. Number one, free run. Uh, let's do race. Which one am I? Free. Go, go, go. Oh, I don't hear any background music. Quad challenge. Here we go. I'll change to high gear. There we go. Let's try and catch him up now. So I've got a timer of 46 seconds. To catch him up. There he is. Got a better turning than, than him there. Over the jump, into the lead. Sharp right hand corner now. Oh, how did he overtake me there? He obviously did a better turn in than me. He's just gone off in the distance. Okay, oh, he slowed down a bit there. We're catching him up. Out of the way. Move. Oh, oh. Oh, what? Oh, okay, we, we'll end that there. Whew, quad challenge. That was number nine, so we're on to number ten now. Star Luster, 1985. Training, command, adventure. Um, Let's do adventure. Sounds like Zelda. Did 
Okay, destroy all the enemies. Let's go to this point on the map. Whoa, light speed. So there they are on the map. Let's go. Was that just there? I just missed it. No, it is there. Is that an enemy? Or is that Earth? Planet lock on. Oh, it weren't really locked on, was it? Where's that planet gone? There it is. Do we go to it? What? Do I smash it? I can't smash blow up a planet. What do I do with this? Oh, press the X button, it gives rapid fire. And that Y button does nothing. Next game, don't know what I'm doing with that one. Right, okay, what's this? Zevus, whatever it is. Exus. That's a planet. It is a planet. But, uh, I didn't know what I was doing on it. Oh, look at that. Look. Go over the text. Oh, okay, so it's like a 1942 shooter. A vertical shooter. These are all awesome. Reason why I'm saying, oh, what's this again? It's been so long since I played this cartridge, I forgot what was actually on them. And this is the last game on the Namco Museum Collection cartridge. And then we'll be moving on to the Data East one after that. So, yeah, some big hitters on that one. That's my, my favourite cartridge, the Data East one. So, I've not unboxed the Jalico or Pico Collection 2 at the moment of filming this video. I say filming, I'm live streaming it, so. This is live, if you're watching it back, it's not live. So yeah, just uh, tapping A and dodging away from bullets, that's what you do in these games. It looks very much like a Master System game, this one. Very action fighter colours. And that's enough of that. Right, okay. So that's all 11 games on the Namco Museum Collection 1. So we're going to move over to... How it's pronounced. X Vius Bias Vial I don't know. Okay, so next one. Data East. I can't pronounce things because you know. Wasn't well educated on those Namco games names. So Data East now. My favourite cartridge. Here we go. Another NES game. You can see the file has been updated on this one, so there's been some key mapping on some of the games. Let's do it. Ten games on this one, so the final cart for this evening's stream. So here we go. And then I've got another live stream coming up soon. If you check your... If you're subscribed, you should uh, hit that reminder button. And then you uh, will be reminded when I go live. So Blade or Striker, let's be Blade. There we go. Who's that dude? The President's daughter has been arrested. Oh, so this President has been kidnapped, as always, by ninjas. Oh. Are you a bad... Are you a bad enough dude to rescue the President? I think so. What's this? Here we go. Oosh, oosh, oosh. So what's the keys again? That's jump. That's punch. Right, okay. Is there another move? No, just jump and punch. Let's go. Let me press them both. Okay. It's so long since I played it. Let's go, let's go. The nice NES graphical glitches. Let's get those. Oh, watch out. Let's get the time. Come on, the ninjas. Have you got the president? Dudes is a truck. Nice music, nice graphics on this one, as you would expect. Oh! There's me, I'm back. He's got a sword, I want that. 
Very Ninja Gaiden, that guy there. Have that. Oh, he's a big dude. He's a bad dude. Oh. Can do like rolling thunder, can jump up the uh, backdrop. There we go. Oh, get off me. We're back. Have some of that. I'm a bad dude. Oosh. There he goes. Yeah. Whoa, what the? Nice. Love Data East. Yes, Data East is awesome. Hopefully they do an arcade cartridge. Look at the music kicking off now. Have some of that. can there. Nice health. Whoa, whoa. Oh, I'm on the road. Quick. Oh. How's he walking on the road then? Come on. Oh, a drop kick there from him. Look at him gliding through. Oh no! Get out of there. Gas it. Oh, he's got the sword. Oh, he killed me. Oh, that's that changed the game. So ten games in this cartridge. Bump and jump. This game is also cool, but it's burning rubber. Eight-bit game. What's your favourite Data East game, Sega Socks? And I saw your stream earlier. I was going to pop by, but a bit busy making dinner, so uh, I'll watch it back. I've got you. I'm subscribed to your channel, so I will check out that live stream you did earlier. What's this? That's break. How do you jump again? That one. That's it. So yeah, once again, very action fighter looking like this one. So you just uh, bump or jump them. You got to jump over these. Oh. So you can see on the top right hand side, it shows you how long's left of the level. So it's decreasing down from 50. So forth. Whoa, there we go. They can bump those ones, the small ones, but you jump on the bigger one to get the points. Whoa. It's all quick action, this is. Collect this and pee or. Petrol? Oh, it's not the time then, it must be the petrol. I've only got seven bits of petrol left. Oh! How's that petrol on the water? Ding! So, yeah, my petrol is on the right hand side. Oh, I keep missing it. Oh, no. That's a difficult game. It's a good game. Right, next. Burger Time. Okay, so another popular game. 8 bit one. Data East, 1985. Number 3 on the cartridge out of 10. Burger Time. Okay, so. I think you have some pepper that you have to uh, use. Let's create those tasty burgers. Say get rid of that egg. Oh, sausage. Oh, what? It's stamping on my head. Put the lettuce down. So let's do the bun bases and put the lettuce down on the top of that beef patty. And uh, there's an ice cream there. Oh, it's gone. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, it knocks them down, that's cool. God, he's quick, that sausage. God, that burger bun just fell all the way down. Whoa, what? Whoa. That one's done. I'm out of pepper. 
unless I stock up at the top. Whoa! Oh no. Two crude dudes and Kelver are both great. Well, you're in for a treat because uh, one of those is on here. Du, 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 du. Watch out for that silly sausage. Oh, I'm dead. Come on. Can't you top up the pepper? What's that thing at the top left? There must be something to do to top up the pepper. Hey, got 500 points. Let's go up there. It's got to be a replenished bit. Oh, what? Wasted it. The one bit of pepper I had, I wasted it. Oh, come on now, look. I can't jump. Great. Well, oh, got one more life left. <laughs> Have that. Right, okay. Whoa! Oh, so I've made two burgers. Not bad, I guess. Okay, right. So, we are on to two crude dudes. One of my, it is my favourite game on the Evercade. So this bit, the intro is going to be hurting your eyes. So I do apologise for flashing lights now. Close your eyes if you wanted to. Woo! God, nearly having a fit on the floor. I'll skip that because I don't want it to give anyone an epileptic fit. So two crude dudes, let's do it. So this is the console version, the Mega Drive version. Where is the music? Is there music? There's no music on this one. Let me just go back, because I'm sure there should be sound on this one. Let's try that again. Yeah, no sound. Very peculiar. Oh, I've jacked up the sound a bit. Look how cool this looks. Hey! Oosh. Get down. I don't like those little yellow guys. Yeah, you punched him in the head. Oh! Just don't like them. That's it. Get off. Oh, it's killed me. Used to play this in the arcades. With the bro. Pretty awesome game. Can't wait to play this on the Evercade VS. Two players. Have that. Hey, it did, 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 did. Have that. Oh, not him again. Kicked in the head. Do, do, do. Get out of it. He looks cool. Oh, dead again. Whoa. 
Him and his boomerang. Have some of that. Oh, I should have uh, thrown it on these guys. Get out of it. Whoa, take the snake, Roberts. Come down here. Like that. Where are you going? With his high boots. Very uh, feminine boots here on him. Oh, kick to the head. Oh no, not the snake. Oh man. Okay. Awesome game. Let's turn that down a little bit. What we've got here now. Fighter's history. Do do do. Oh, sounds very Super Nintendo. Fighters History, 1994, Data East Corporation. Computer Battle, Survival versus Setup. We'll do Survival. Matlock. Let's go, Matlock. Matlock buff. Alright, who go can it be? Huh, that's um reminds me of a British wrestler. Giant Haystack or someone or Let's be the Ryu looking like female character. Oh, it's changed the outfit, great. Um thank you. Kent. Um. There we go. Oh, I've got a nice sound board as well. Oh, this looks good. It is in Matlock. This is Matlock Bath. In England, in the bookshop, the background. It's not got the uh, the Street Fighter moves. Well, it might have. No, I'm trying to do it. Trying to pull him off. Oh, he's got him. Have that kick to the head. Oh, yes. There we go. It looks like a... What's that Street Fighter character? That's like that. Uh, not Eagle. What's the one? Fe not not Phelon. He's on Street Fighter 1. Oh. Birdie could be. No, it's not Birdie. Oh, Dazed. Oh, Head again. Same moves. Ryoto. Ryoto. Here we go, round three. Look at this guy. We've got any cool moves with this fella? Zangief looking character. That guy there is very street fire like. Have that drop kick. Policeman out the back there. 
It's not happy. Dead. Right, next game. You're on number six out of ten on the final disc tonight, our final cartridge, the data disc. The data disc? No, that's a vinyl. Data East. Jaramac 2. 16 bit platformer. Is he going to bite it? Is he going to refire? No. There they are. Jarmac 2 Lost in the Tropics. So yeah, this will be pretty cool as a two-player game on the Evercade VS. <laughs> okay. So let's start. What's he doing? Oh, he's found a bone. And a crown. Let's nick the crown, huh? Right, last night, a caveman, looked like that, named Gork, came and stole that. Okay, so we, got, we have to go and get it back. Let's jump. Let's hit. Cool. Oh. First, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is probably telling me what I've got to do. First, go to the Toki village. Let's go. What's this? No one's here. Can't get in. Why? Right, the door's open. Huh? Huh? Let's go. Oh, this looks nice and colourful. Let's go. So, oh, beat up the little dinosaurs. It's not good, is it? Just beat up everything then. Until I find. Oh, it turns into a little turkey. I'll shoot the bones out of him, yeah, very impressive. Get rid of that snail. No one likes eating snails apart from the French. Wait. What do you want? It's got a hundred and slap. Dropped a cog or an old donut. Get rid of the little baby dinosaurs, which is not good. Can't go down there. What's this? This oh, a Sonic uh, a Knuckles or Sonic 3 sort of element to it. Can we go this way? Get a turkey. Yup. Nope. Got the bones of that turkey. Can't get him. Add that. Whoa, the bridge changes. Right, okay. Get out of it. Big turkey. Yes. Have that. You did. What's that? That checkpoint. Oh, pepper. Fire. Oh, get off. It's locked. What's this? There's the key. I got the key. I got the secret. Let's go. Okay, we're at the heels.
So yeah, clearly this uh, data east collection is pretty awesome. Whoa, what's that? When he comes out of this one. Ride the worm. Let's go. What's that? Get back here. Oh, I can't be asked for that. Oh, you gotta do it. To get up there. Okay. Do 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 do. What's this? Let's go. Prepare for a wild ride. Let's do it. That was wild. Right, next game. Right, number seven of ten, Karate Champ, Data East. Whoa. Okay, so let's give this a go then. There is Cry Champ. Intro again. 1986, an older one from Data East here. Yes. So what we got then? That kick, punch. Oh, in his face. Reverse punch. White. Oh, knocked me out there. Oh, and again. A front kick awarded to the red team. Have that kick to the chest. Oh, punch. Three, I won. Right, okay, begin. Oh, a little trip. Watch out. You're facing the wrong way. Oh, kick to the back of the head. Next game. Number 8 of 10. So, yeah, not many to go until we're finished tonight's stream. Cool, it's been a good one. That's a big enough logo, isn't it? Right. Here it is. Another awesome game. Once again, very SNES-like, Super Nintendo. Thank you for watching. If you are live on YouTube, do appreciate it. It does mean a lot. What's that on the red? Oh, it's an eye. It's got three eyes. Magic Drop 2. 1996. Start. Endless mode, battle mode. Aha, uh -huh, mode. Wait, is that going to be a karaoke mode? Story mode. Let's do a battle mode. Nope, press the wrong button. Battle mode it is then. Timed, normal, calm. Do normal. How are you doing, Ginger Hippie Gaming 42? Hope you're well. Thanks for stopping by. Got to check out your live streams and your videos as well soon i've got to catch up with everything just been a bit busy as of late let's be the poster girl there she is okay so battle mode is two players so let's change that then because uh until we get the evercade vs then we can't do two player mode that's a bit odd so Let's try that again then. We'll do uh, endless mode. Keep it on normal. Hopefully, be the character that we just was, unless uh, we can't change that. Okay, so this person, right. So pick up a gem and then go and put it into the same location. There we go. Alright. Sword. Because the swords are in the gold ones, you can see that. Three. Huh. 
red ones. Left arrow. Oh gosh. Green one, throw in there. Blue ones. So if you're a fan of Buster Movie style games, you might like this one. You can use that door over there, which I'm going to use now. It's getting rather difficult now. Oh no. Blue. Red. Use those swords again. Need to use this one right after. Chuck it there. Whoa. Another up arrow. Not got no spare spaces. Green. <laughs> There's a green over. Oh no, put it in the wrong place. Sword. Need to use that sword. Nice one. Right, okay. Clover. There you go. Oh yes. Get that green over there. Doing all right. We're doing okay now. Get that blue gone. Oh, it's all kicking off now. Get that red now. Then get the green. Oh, it's going quick. Green's gone. Oh no! Oh, what's happening now? Oh, squished. Right, not played this one. You have not? No, it's uh, it's an awesome game. Pretty fun, and I can't wait to play it on two-player mode. Right, here we go. Midnight Resistance. A popular game. Got this on the Amstrad CPC four six four. Data East collection this is. Here we are. You can just press and hold or just press the A button and it just uh, shoots constantly. So I've got to click the keys as well. But I'll just click them when it uh, when they drop, I'm not getting off this cart. Oh Sound again is low. Hello, hello, hello. Can you hear me over this? I need to turn that sound down. Alright, okay, so yeah, the sound is quite high. Let's go. It's odd. You turn the sound on the Evercade up and it turns it up on the actual uh, stream as well. Oh, it's very odd. Very odd indeed. Let's just play. Not my favourite game, this one, to be honest with you. Ooh. I'm going to try that again. Just spent too much trying, time trying to sort out the audio. Oh, what's this? No, I want to start that actually again. I don't want to do that. Do -do 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 -do. Okay, so let's just do it. If it works, it works. If not, don't worry about it.
Let's go. Go, buddy. Let's take out this tank. Uh-oh. Oh. Stuck here now, aren't I? Let's get out of there, quick. Chuck that bomb. Oh, why did I do that? Evening, Georgie Slasher Gaming. Popping to say hey. Hey there. Thanks for stopping by. Right, so we're going to pick a freeway. If I can afford it. Can't afford it. Oh, I've not got no keys. Watch out for the grade. So if you found a Contra, you might like this game. But this level looks very Forgotten Worlds-like. Oh, that tanks again, so the first level boss is now just appeared on the uh, second level. Oh. Nope. Next game. Here we go. So this is the final game on the cartridge, the Data East Collection 1. Whoa. Side pocket. Okay, hello. Been watching Feed Me. Oh, yes, it's his uh, stream. I'll be checking that out. He's doing it for 24 hours a day. Yes, I'll promote it on my channel. So I will check that out. So this is the last one anyway. Then I'll go and check that out afterwards. Very nice lady in outfit there in Los Angeles. Can't do the Mark Williams break off, but we'll give it a go. So I've got to put it in the side pocket. What was that? Lots of us in the chat, James, mate. Nice one, yeah, there is a, a lot in this chat as well, and uh, I will be heading over to that after this, because this is the final game of this evening. Hey, trick. Cue ball going. Damn it. Three bowls left. That should be. Oh, I need it over that pocket. So let's uh, let's figure this out. So if I'm going to hit just in there. Nearly, worth a go. There you go, nicely potted. Oh. Let's try and hit underneath it. It's going to be difficult.
don't know how I'm going to do this. Um, just going to smack it. Oh, nearly. Tom Cruise, yes. Getting very slick. Oh, look, look at that for a side pocket. Let's just smack this over here. Do, 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 do. Let's pop this one and hopefully I'll get to... different side pocket for that blue one. The zone. Alright, let's just smack this in. placements of these. Hold on. Oh. Could do something with that. No. Come on, be the far left. Oh. finish this until I put it into the zone. Oh. Is it going to be that side pocket over there? Uh, side pocket and that is the end of this stream so we played all three cartridges from one to three so that was the Atari collection one that was the Namco Museum collection one and the Data East collection one so if you have enjoyed this video please click on that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already and thank you everybody that's been in the chat it does mean a lot it's nice to see all of you and uh, yeah I've enjoyed this evening got another live stream we'll be playing through cartridges number four five and six next time as well and then we're just going to keep playing through all of them until we get to all of them done and then when they release more then i'll do more but uh yeah hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you again next time take care of yourself all the best bye bye